Hi, John here with LPN. In a previous video, I offered a brief demonstration of the new textbooks feature in iBooks 2 for the iPad. If your YouTube viewer supports embedded links, you can see that video by clicking right here, or you can just click the link in the video description. In this video, I wanted to offer a quick look at one of the more valuable tools that Apple has included in textbooks for the iPad, the study cards. To access the study cards feature, just tap the notes icon to bring up the notes menu and you'll see a listing of any of the notes you've created for this textbook. Tap the study cards button to bring up the study cards and you'll see a number of cards that have been sourced from the glossary terms of this textbook. These cards have been designed to help you memorize these terms and their meanings. And you can tap the rotate button to flip the cards over and review the definitions. Additionally, if you've created any notes for this textbook, you can include those in your study cards to more effectively commit that important content to memory. And if you've also categorized any of your study cards separately, designated by color, you could even choose which of those categories to include in your study cards. And that's pretty cool. You want to improve your memory retention for your studies? Be sure to check out Textbooks Study Cards in iBooks 2 for the iPad. I think you'll dig it. I'm John with LPM. Thanks for watching.